Hello YouTube. We just thought we would show you one of the ways that we save slash make money. And that is that I seem to, for some reason, need a haircut about every two weeks. And my wife, having been a licensed beautician at one point in her life, it just kind of makes sense that she cut my hair. So, yeah, I saw someone else doing this on the internet the other day, and uh, I thought, you know, great minds surely must work alike, because <laughs> we had it planned, but they did it first, so that's okay. Well, it's nice seeing uh, everybody say here and there. So if you just think about one haircut a month, which isn't enough for me, um, it's just, uh, what, about 15 bucks to get a haircut anymore around here. And it's probably more or less in other places, but that's just like making money if you don't have to spend it. And believe me, folks, I'm not cheap and I'm not tight. But if I, want to, if I want to continue to live in the custom that we're used to, we just got to cut corners when we can and be smart with how we spend our money. And she'll probably uh, cut all my hair off for this, but guess what? I help her cut her hair too. <laughs> <laughs> so, so we're saving twice as much money that way. Oh gee, I'm uh, still trying to work on that garden project and get those trees cut down. But it's rained here all but two days for the last, uh, I want to say, two to three weeks. Not a lot, just enough that you can't get out and do anything. So, uh, at least, hopefully, the ground is uh, thawed enough where I can get the fence and the posts out. And if I get a dry day, I'm going to go out and fall those trees and cut them up. And pretend that we're going to very, very soon put a garden out. However, it will probably be, oh, I don't know, 1st of May or something like that before we start to set plants out into the garden. What do you think? Well, I think it'll be sooner than May, but I hesitate to talk about it because every time I have plans to do something, um, it'll be zero again, or raining for four days, five days straight. Yeah, the weather's not been good to us at all, really. Uh, uh, a colder than normal winter, and it seems to me like longer, but you know, it's good to have a, a good cold winter once in a while. It kills the bugs, the, the bad bugs, and makes Mother Nature know what's going on. Anyway, I was going to say something and I forgot what it was. Maybe it'll come to me in a minute. Well, you know, having four children, it was just almost a necessity to learn how to cut hair. Yeah. I better try to hold still here too or I'm going to have hair missing where it shouldn't be. You probably I've, never notice. I've got some uh, video where I have tried to work on that, that garden thing out there and I'll, I may throw it up with uh, this little haircut thing. But uh, I don't know. We were anxious to do a video and I gotta admit that content is a little hard to come by at this time of year so you know we do <laughs> the best we can just try to keep people up to speed and and let everybody know that we're uh, we're thinking about you and uh, we want you to, 
to know that if we were just able to get out and do something, we'd have more content for you. We may go back and do a couple more, uh, we'll let Carol do a couple more uh, things in the kitchen too, actually. It's been a while since she's done anything. Are you up for that? Sure, anytime. Well, okay. Looks like I've about got a haircut done here, so I think we'll bid you farewell for the haircut part, and uh, well, I'll go through and see what kind of video I've got that we can put up that might be of interest to you. Well, that's it. It doesn't take long to get a haircut, especially anymore. Not much to cut. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you. Thanks, guys. Thank you.